I like to say, I went from you know, traveling the country to everything was within three miles. Talk about a culture shock, huh. right? And yeah. everything was right here. None of my friends were stay-at-home moms. Who? None of them. Did they you feel lonely? Very lonely. Very, very lonely. Um, so what that what happened there? So I started looking around. I would I go to the park and I would say I'm trying to pick up moms at the park because I'd uh -huh. see someone pushing their daughter and I'd go over. So hi, do you live around here? You know, trying to meet other moms in that situation. I started going to township committee meetings wow. because it was time away and it was other adults. Was a, I'm almost was, mad you didn't get the real estate debt. Well, that I'm hearing but it all it all led all things all red. It's it's so funny because all of that came to <laughs> came to fruition and. And you know, the more I got involved in the town, huh. so I had my own little Christmas shop, and I got involved. Yeah, so you, let's you started building relationships while you were raising your kids because yes. it's like, all right, now what? And then, where did the idea come with the shop? So for the Christmas shop or this business? Yeah, the Christmas shop. So, so while I was still working in radio, I sat down and planned out one day and said, okay, when I, I want to have kids, I want to be home, I want to have a business, and I looked around at different types of businesses. I fell in love with this property in a magazine for Mullica Hill and I loved the area, came and found it and went, okay, maybe we can do this in a couple of years. He did it five months later. <laughs> so oh, wow. it was like one of those I sat down and planned out, put up together a five year plan and it literally came together in five months. Wow. wow. Right. So it was well, if you look at my Facebook page, Jay, yeah. Right, it says once you once you make a decision the universe conspires to make it happen, I completely believe in that. My, that's my life story, your life story. It is. So that was, so that all came together with me opening the shop. I had that business for four years before I left radio. Okay. So I ran the business. They, it took me a little while to have the family. So I did all of that at the same time. What? Okay. So people always ask, you know, where they can buy more time. What is your process then to be able to juggle a family? Radio business and a shop. It was it was chaos. It was I mean I hired so people to help. So you, you're honest. Then. <laughs> it was chaos. We're not gonna it sell the course on the they, you know the time walk. No, yeah, it's chaos. no, it was chaos. 